tend to define myself by other people, uh, whether that's other people's relationships with me or other people's opinions of me. I tend to put other people's opinions above my own way more than I should. Um, normally for this project, this kind of project, I'd show some kind of like knickknack that I had at my house, my apartment, something that I brought with me to college that I deemed valuable enough to bring with me. But unfortunately, I don't have the luxury this weekend. I'm at my family's house, which has given me an opportunity to look back at some of the things I left behind, um, including this project that I did in psychology in high school. In this project, I had to, well, make a collage to define myself and write an essay, but I also had to have my friends use words to define me. And I'll read a couple of them now. Um, brash. Powerful, knowledgeable, overdramatic, unpredictable, hostile, intelligent, stubborn, clever, confident. This wasn't really how I saw myself, and I was really insecure in high school. But this made me realize, this project, working on it, working with friends on it, made me realize that the self-doubt and insecurities that I carried inside weren't what other people were seeing. The insecurities that I had weren't being scrutinized in the way that I had always assumed they were. All of my anxieties about people judging me, people thinking badly of me, were basically unfounded, I realized, due to this project. And that's something I've carried with me for a long time. I mean, realizing that insecurities are not as visible as we think they are. That the things that we're worried about aren't what other people are looking at. This has really been important to me, and I've said I've carried it with me, and I use it all the time, of this confidence that I gained from this. The realization that if I were to act confident, I would never be recognized as anything but confident, and I would feel confident as well. And I think that is really important, and it really defines how I act and the way that I live my life now.